Hi, this is Vic, and before I talk about the Cadillac ELR, I want to first leave you with a leave you with a quick a quick mention of the Cyberknife. You notice I changed the graphic of the the Fight Like a Spartan, uh, uh, the Fight Like a Spartan sign. I put the URL of Cyberknife.com on there because I felt I feel it's important. If if a person is interested. And the cyber knife is curious about the cyber knife to discover what the cyber knife can do. They can you can use you can go to cyberknife.com and use their search feature. And by entering your zip code, it will tell you of a hospital that's cl the closest hospital to you that has a cyber knife facility in it. Um, I was fortunate enough fortunate enough to have a cyber knife facility, a hospital that had a cyber knife facility uh, within a brief driving, a short driving distance from me. Um, like I said, during my course of treatment for five days, I would drive over there and lay down for 45 minutes, fully dressed, without being cut on, lay down for 45 minutes and uh, go to work. And I did that every single day. And there's absolutely zero interruption between my private life uh, and my wife's and I and I private life. There was no interruption in that, and the cyber knife cured me of my prostate cancer. Now the cyber knife does in fact kill cancer or tumors in various parts of the male or female body. Either you know the lung cancer, lung tumors, and or the brain, depending upon the, the patient. Now some some doctors may or may not know what the cyber knife can do. Uh, my doctor, for example, did not know of the cyber knife. The oncologist that worked with the cyber knife knew exactly what it could do. Um, and the doctor, well, there, there was a, uh, a technician uh, under the supervision of a doctor that um, um, gave me my treatments. It's absolutely glorious, too. Now, the reason for the band is I'm challenging everyone to please wear to please wear a band that is the color of the crimson color of a Spartan to show your support for fighting prostate cancer. September each and every September every year is Prostate Cancer Awareness Month. And I would like I'm challenging everyone, man, woman or child, male or female, doesn't matter, show your support for fighting this prostate cancer is easily it's easily destroyable uh, by using the cyber knife it destroyed my cancer I'm cancer free have been since 2007 it is now 2015 Hi. Right, in this presentation I'm going to talk about the ELR obviously but what I will not talk about on, a, on an extended basis is the miles per gallon average I mean, as if you've watched any of my previous postings, you know that the MPG average of my ELR has gone up tremendously based on my discovering mountain mode. Okay, here is, I'm starting up the car by pressing the power button. In order, in order to energize the car, you have to have your foot on the brake and press the power button at the same time. And the driver, informa driver information console is lit up, monitoring my tire pressure, which is where I like it to be. And the CIC, that's an acronym that I borrowed from the Navy. My center information console, or, or as I call it, CIC, is now, you see my Bluetooth device is connected, which is my, my iPhone. My car knows my phone. Um, intimately and um, I'm gonna go ahead and tap on the energy icon and I have mine set up to charge at to charge immediately upon plug-in but I'm not going to change it I can change it to delay charging based on departure time I typically keep mine set on to charge start charging immediately you see my lifetime there is now 81.6. Remember, when I first discovered mountain mode about eight days ago, my average was 
As a result of discovering mountain mode, I'm able to average well over 100 miles per gallon. And there's uh, CIC, another control screen that CIC can do. Uh, it can control uh, air conditioning. And now that's a GPS. And that's a, a demonstration of what the area looks like based on where I am. And this is a telephone, the telephone module. If I wanted to call someone, I can, I can use the, the keypad to call them. Obviously, I'm not going to call the 555-1212 uh, number. And I also have, and because my phone knows my, or because my car, excuse me, knows my phone so intimately, it also has my contacts. If I want to call a particular contact, they're listed alphabetically. I can, I can go ahead and just tap on the contact icon and they will display. And there's the contacts. If I want to call one of those contacts, um, I, would, I would just press on, press on the name, and it would prompt me to, then, and then I can hit the dial button. I think there's a dial button after, after that. And here's another function of, the, uh, of CIC. I can control my sound system either from, I typically keep mine on XM radio, or if I wanted to get music from my iPhone, I have a, a decent list of, of music on my, on my iPhone. If I want to get music from my iPhone, I can play it from my iPhone wirelessly. And there's absolutely no noticeable sound or loss of sound quality at all. And here's an example of some of the things that, that the driver information console can monitor. I'm tapping on, on a control on the right-hand side of the steering wheel. And oil life, that's a good thing. Okay, oil life, I have 25% of my oil life remaining. I have not changed the oil in this car yet. I have over 17,000 miles in the car. I have not changed the oil at all. Not yet. I've had the car over a year, and I have 25% of oil life remaining with 17,000 miles on the car. And the reason I have so much oil life remaining is because I drive my car. Most of my miles are accumulated on my car from the electric motor, from, from the electric power supply, from the electricity that was stored in the power supply when the car was charged not from the engine running and generating electricity. If my engine was running generating so much electric, more electricity, if I was dependent upon the engine more, then I would have to change my engine engine oil have my engine oil changed much much more often. And that's it. And that's another advantage of having having an extended range electric vehicle.